Hey, Mark and Michael back again with our career Ask Me Anything. So uh, this question, even got it in front of me, comes up from Summer, name and address withheld. Uh, so Summer says, uh, hi, Mark and Michael. Thanks for the chance to share my question with you. My name is Summer, and I'm in technology transformation in the financial industry. Being successful in my role means establishing relationships across many different organizations at my firm. But when in tedious or difficult work situations, I've been described as having an assertive personality which I feel has benefited me and feels like a positive trait, but others may not feel the same. Um, can we shift the paradigm to view assertiveness as a positive? And as a follow-up question, how do we market ourselves as strong and influential leaders knowing that the assertive part of our personality may be viewed as negative, but is sometimes a required part of the deal? Thanks, guys. So she's been told she's assertive. She's not sure if that's positive or negative. Mark, where would you start with that one? Here's where I go with this, and this is classic advice that I give many, many leaders across the planet, is assertiveness on its own can have some negative connotations, but you don't need to change the frame around that or the paradigm, as it's been called there. You just need to add one last characteristic, which is calm, calm and assertive. Nobody ever was, you know, got annoyed with anybody for being too calm and assertive. Too calm, yes. Too assertive. If I say, you know, I, I was I was a little too assertive, you'd probably go, yeah, you maybe were. I was a little too calm in that situation. Yeah, you probably were. I was a little too calm and assertive in that situation. No, you can't be too calm and assertive. So what I'd like to do is just to, you know, help this person to go, look, make sure when you're being assertive, that you're always being calm and assertive, and, and that will never be a bad look for you. There's my idea on that one, Michael. Well, what do you got? I love that. And what I would do is I would actually build upon that. And you know, one of the things that I'm, I'm really in favor of, and you and I talk about this all the time with our clients, is how do you check in? How do you get feedback? But also, how do you telegraph what you're doing? So if you have this assertiveness, you know, I, I've heard assertive, especially, unfortunately, with uh, people of a female gender, be code for, oh, they're bitchy, you know, as opposed to strong. I mean, we have that gender thing that pops in. So what you want to do, I think, is also frame that you're calm and assertive. So maybe a type of thing where you go to one or two people and say, hey, one of the things I'm really working on is making sure that I'm calm and assertive at the same time. I'd love your thoughts on that after the meeting. Or after the meeting, say, how is that? Did I come across both calm and assertive? Because that's really what I was trying to do. And it does two things. One, it gives you feedback as to how well you showed up, given what you wanted to show up as, calm and assertive, like Mark says. And two, it lets people know that's what you're going for. And they'll actually talk about that. Well, you know, I mean, Summer, she's trying to be calm and assertive. That's what you're getting there. That's not angry or nasty. That's calm and assertive. Or that's not withdrawn. That's calm and assertive. So I think advertising where you're going can be really clear. It's really about great branding, isn't it? If you put the right words and actions around yourself, tell people what to think and feel around that, you'll soon hear that they're telling that story to other people. They've got a story in their head around your behaviors being, oh, you know, way too assertive. You rebrand as calm and assertive, they'll join in. That's it. Absolutely. Sounds great. Well, uh, for your questions, uh, like Summer, you want to reach out to us, you can go to michaellecky.com forward slash ask. That's to get a hold of both of us. We take all of our questions there, and you can also pop them to us on LinkedIn or any other place that you uh, make contact with us, but michaellecky.com forward slash ask for our career. Ask me anything. Thanks for joining us, and we'll uh, see you on the next question. Yeah.